Good evening, I'm Chris Thomas. Thanks for joining us. The results are now coming in for election night. Keep in mind the polls closed in just the last hour and ABC 10's Andy Judson is live at the Sacramento County Board of Elections. Andy, how are things going tonight so far? Yeah, Chris, just because voting is now over doesn't mean that it's over here at the elections office. Actually, they're just getting started and it's going to be a long night as well as a long couple weeks ahead. I'm going to step out of the frame here to show you exactly what's going on. Specifically in this room that we're showing you, they're tabulating votes from in person voting from today. Now there's a long four step process, which you got a peek of earlier this evening for your ballot to actually get to this room, including verifying your signature. But this is specifically where your vote is counted and that's why in this room the computers are not connected to the internet and obviously there's very limited access which is why we're outside of it and looking through it through these windows and it's also live streamed on elections.sacccounty.gov if you want to watch it in action now altogether there's about 864,000 registered voters in Sacramento and so far they've tabulated just under 100,000 specifically 98,562 ballots so far but that's not an official count of all the ballots that have come in they won't have that until they got they get back all those ballots including mail in over the next several days and you know they're going to they're going to continue that work through the night and that's because while the voting is over and many races have been called from what the votes have revealed so far, but in actuality, it takes the elections office a couple of weeks to verify all of these votes that have come in. They need to check all of those signatures and they need to really make it official. Specifically here in Sacramento County, they have 29 days to verify those election results. And they told me earlier today, they're gonna take every single one of those days if they need to. So it's just getting started here at the elections office, Chris, but for now, we'll send it back to you guys. Mm -hmm. Andy Justin with a live look as the votes are being counted. Andy, thank you. Let's look at the numbers. Right now in the race for Attorney General, Democrat Rob Bonta in the lead with 59% of the vote against Republican Nathan Hockman with 17% of the vote. In the race for Sheriff in Sacramento County, Jim Cooper is leading Jim Barnes by more than 12,000 votes. Cooper has almost 57% of the vote and Barnes has 43%. 11.5% of the votes have been counted so far there. Tin Ho is leading against his opponent, Alana Matthews, as we speak. Ho has just about 59% of the vote. This is for district attorney. Uh, Matthews at 41%. It's still early with 11% of the total votes in so far. In the race for district attorney in San Joaquin County, it is a close race tonight. Ron Freitas has a slight lead over incumbent Tory Salazar. Freitas has about 51% of the vote in so far. Salazar has 49% of the vote, but keep in mind, just about 4% of the vote is in for San Joaquin County. In the congressional race for District 3, Kermit Jones is in the lead over Republicans Kevin Kiley and Scott Jones. Again, the votes are still coming in as we speak. This has been an ABC 10 primary election night update. Stay with ABC 10 for the very latest information on Late News Tonight at 11. And now back to regularly scheduled programming.